The human brain. It's one of the most powerful machines around. Simulating a single second of its activity needs almost 85,000 processes. The brain is a multi-scale, very complex entity and we have, to, we have to look at all the different levels of detail to understand it. There's still so much we don't know. Like how to fix the brains of dementia patients, how to harness our subconscious, and why we dream. Human Brain Project is a 10-year effort to advance our understanding of the human brain and to develop new treatments for medicine and new uh, technologies based on the brain. We are generating more and more data about the brain in laboratories all around the world. But until we bring that data together and put it, see how the pieces fit together, we won't have a coherent picture of how the brain actually functions. Scientists from across Europe are using decades of research already done on brain function to build a working model of the brain and simulate it on a supercomputer. It's an enormous task. They've got 10 years and more than $2 billion to try to make it happen. In the long term, towards the end of the project, our goal is to have an exascale supercomputer. So this is an extraordinarily fast supercomputer um, that would be capable of running a simulation of the human brain at the level of individual cells. There's one problem. The technology, it doesn't exist yet. If scientists are going to simulate the brain, they're going to need a computer that's 35 times faster than today's supercomputer. That's as powerful as 100 million laptops. With the project set to last 10 years, it may be a while until we start to see results. Until then, it's bound to cause a few headaches.